What's up YouTubers, this is Acubai here and today I'm going to show you how to fix OBS Studio display capture back screen. So currently I have a monitor capture scene set up and in that I have the display capture source. As you can see this is my current display right here. It has been selected and I'm going to click OK and as you can see nothing actually shows up. As you can see there is a red dot right here at the corner. So what we'll have to do is we'll have to right click on the display capture source and then go to transform and then click on fit to screen right here. Now as you can see that the red frame has been extended but still the monitor capture or display capture is not showing up in the preview screen. So this happens because of OBS Studio actually running on a different graphics card than your monitor display. So to fix this go to the start menu and then search for graphics settings. Now once we are here we'll have to click on browse and we'll have to find the folder in which our OBS studio has been installed the program files folder so I actually installed it on the D drive but by default it installs on the C drive so you'll have to find it in the program files or program files x86 folder and the folder will be named OBS dash studio by default I had renamed the upper folder but it will be named like this so now we can click on this and then go into bin then 64 bit and it might be 32 bit for our 32 bit users and then we'll have to click on OBS 64 and and this might be OBS 32 or just OBS for our 32 bit users and then we'll have to click on add. As you can see it says specified app was already added because I have done this before so it will show up something like this right here. Now we'll have to click on this then we'll have to click on options and now as you can see it is on system default currently and what we can do is we can change it to power saving and this one is the one which our display uses this is the graphics card which our display uses so once we click on power saving we'll have to click on save and now we'll just have to restart OBS studio so now as you can see the display capture actually shows up in the preview screen of OBS studio and this issue has been fixed if you're getting this black screen issue while capturing your game by using the game capture source you can check out this video which will be up on the card and at the end the screen and even in the description to fix that. So I hope you found this video helpful and if you did please consider to leave a like and comment down below if you are facing any problems or have any suggestions. Subscribe to me for more content which helps out new YouTubers and make sure to hit the bell icon to get notified. Thanks for watching and roll the outro.